Hi ladies, hi gents. Uh, today I want to share a video with you for Wild Orchid Crafts and um, as usual I will pop all the links down below in the description box and um, all the product codes of the items I've used. Um, and it's just a small simple project uh, this week because I've done a lot of quite detailed canvases and that recently so I thought I'd do something a little bit more simple. Um, and this is just the paper mache frame I had in my stash. So I'm just going to show you the, the back of it first because I did um, gesso it and I put this paper on it and glimmer misted it. Because, um, you know, it was a brown paper mache and I, I just wanted to um, cover the back. So that's the back of the frame and it's only a, a very, very uh, thin little frame. And I wanted to keep it quite simple. So if I just reposition down a bit, you can see the full thing. So there's a slight um, depth to the frame, about a centimetre depth. And I used the same uh, paper line in the centre. And I just love the colours because the sun's been shining this weekend. And we've had the most horrific weather recently. So with the sun shining, I wanted to to do a little project that was light and spring feel even though we're not anywhere near spring here yet but that was the idea behind it <laughs> and I just love this image here of the the bird cage and the, the sort of peachy and greens in it and then just over in this corner I uh, cut another section of paper I die cut this ornate um, frame. I'll zoom in a bit. I die cut this ornate frame. The little bird cage is from my stash, which I just gessoed and painted in the peachy colour. There is a half a paper doily here. I don't know if you can see it, you can just see it at the bottom. So this is the paper doily here and I actually stamped some text on there and then gessoed and glimmer misted it but you can just see the doily behind the bird cage peeping out here and the doilies, the paper doilies are actually from Wild Orchid Crafts and they do a mixed set and there's 20 in there and the product code is MKX246. Two, bless me, sorry, excuse me. And there's different ones in there and creams and whites. And these are great for stamping on. I absolutely love them. And they, they have heart ones in there as well, actually. Let me just show you. Pack. This pack, yeah. Oh, they're so pretty. So it's a mixture of different different um, patterns and uh, styles. So and they're a nice size. They're quite small. They're nice size. So that's paper doilies. Okay. Um, on the outside edge of the frame, it was quite wide, and um, I had this beautiful lace from. Wild Orchid Crafts, uh, although I don't think they've got any in stock at the moment, so I'm not going to give you the product code for that while it's it's not in stock at the moment. But that was also from Wild Orchid Crafts. It's beautiful lace, really, really beautiful. Um, just down in this corner, I've just used a, a few appliques, some leaf ones here and here, and then the the little flower appliques. And then in the centre, picking up the coral colour, um, I used some of the flatback um, pearls in the diamond circle that Wild Orchid Crafts sell. And these are so gorgeous and they're a perfect size. And I love the colours that these come in. If you actually get a pack of ten, this little bag's got all mine in that I've got, so to keep them all in one place. But, but you get a pack of ten in a variety of colours and they're mostly pastel and you also get black in there as well but um, 
the product code is MKX657 and you remember you only get 10 in there but all mine are in there so I like to keep them in one place. <laughs> Up in this corner I've just used a butterfly applique um, I love this applique and I just thought it, it was just perfect for this corner. So in the two flower clusters I've kind of mirrored them but then alternated the colours. I'll show you what I mean. So I'll start in this corner. Um, so I started with the trellis roses and these are from the white and cream tone mix in the 40ml and the product code is MKX091. I've used most of the whites, so I do need to get some more more in the white. Um, so in in both corners I've used the trellis roses are exactly the same in both corners. Um, so let me see. So down here I've got some coral colour um, chrysanthemums, and you all know I love these chrysanthemums, and I, I love the pastel colours. And this is the coral one here, and the product code is QVR080. Just put that there for a moment. So that's the the coral chrysanthemums in this corner. Actually, let me zoom out. Because I'll just show you up in this corner. What I've done is I've got the trellis roses, but I used the the aqua pastel aqua chrysanthemums in the opposite corner to the coral ones. So again, that's from the same pack. Okay, then um, the lily flowers, which you all know I absolutely love as well. So I've used the the aqua lily flowers here and here, and I just love the long leaves and the long stems on these. They are so beautiful. And then in the opposite corner, I've used the coral colour um, lily flowers here and here. So let me show you those. And again, these come in a mixed set and the product code is MKX197. And the colours in these packs are beautiful, really, really beautiful. I think I've used all the coral ones out of this, I think I have. Yeah. I've got one of the aqua ones left, but I just love them. They are such a beautiful dimensional flower. They are so gorgeous. And then finally, the other flower that I've used is the magnolias. And um, these are fairly new to Wild Orchid Crafts. They, they got them at the end of last year, I think it was. So here's the magnolia flower in here. And again, absolutely stunning. So I placed the coral one in this corner, and then if I just quickly turn it around, you'll see that I've got the aqua one in the opposite corner. And these are beautiful, really, really beautiful. And again, they come in the mixed pastel tones, and the colours are just so yummy. <laughs> And the product code for these are QVR029. And these are a stunning flower. Really, really stunning. And there's the, the aqua colour here. Just gorgeous. Such beautiful, bright pastel colours. Really beautiful. I love these. I haven't used them enough actually, I must use them more. Um, but you know, I like when they're sat in the packet, I love to look at them because they just brighten my day. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, so that's my um, uh, frame with my bird cage. Um, 
and I really wanted the flowers to be the focus on this piece because you know they really brought out the colour of the papers in here and it is just a simple frame and I absolutely love the colours really really love the colours um, so I hope you like my project and um, hopefully I'll be back soon with another one please please go check out the store they have such beautiful flowers and oh in beautiful colors you know it would be impossible to show you everything they've got because there is so much um, but if you are looking remember for one particular color you can type that name the name of the color in and it'll show you all the flowers they've got in that color so if you type in peach it'll bring out everything in peach up on the website it, it's great it's fantastic um, so please go check them out and I will be back very soon with another project. Bye for now.